Hi there, I'm Dr. Gus Alva, Medical Director of ATP Clinical Research in Costa Mesa, California. Today we're going to be talking about major depressive disorder, which affects close to 35 million people just in the U.S. alone. When someone meets a clinical diagnosis of major depressive disorder, one has to ask what type of an impact does depression have in one's life? What happens to their relationships? What happens to their work output? What happens to their finances or their quality of life? And what was life before that major depressive episode set in? Let's take a look at some important facts. Major depressive disorder is a treatable brain disorder. The symptoms of major depressive disorder occur due to changed levels of activity in specific parts of the brain. We note that brain activity is reduced in major depressive disorder. And a diagnostic tool called positron emission tomography, or a PET scan, measures vital functions such as blood flow, oxygen use, and blood sugar or glucose metabolism. The way that we treat major depressive disorder is through several different treatment modalities. For a long time, we've known that talk therapy can certainly be beneficial. However, drug therapy has been the standard of care for quite a long time. But drug therapy doesn't work for many people, and it may produce unwanted side effects in other parts of the body. There is, however, a new treatment option. Neurostar Transcranial Magnetic Stimulation Therapy is an FDA-cleared depression treatment that is now available throughout the United States. Neurostar Transcranial Magnetic Stimulation Therapy is specifically for patients with major depressive disorder who are not benefiting from their current antidepressant medication. Neurostar TMS therapy is precisely targeted at specific brain regions. To be precise, a key area of the brain known to be underactive in major depressive disorder sufferers called the prefrontal cortex. Neurostar stimulates that area to restore it to normal function and to lift symptoms of major depressive disorder. So, how does it work? Well, Neurostar stimulates neurons in the prefrontal cortex to restore normal function in these local areas. Neurons in the prefrontal cortex communicate to deeper brain neurons. And stimulation of deeper brain neurons causes a secondary effect on remaining portions of the brain involved in mood, which include the left prefrontal cortex, the anterior cingulate cortex, the amygdala, and the hippocampus. Neurostar TMS therapy is a safe technology. In fact, the technology that's utilized by Neurostar TMS therapy is similar to magnetic resonance imaging, or MRI, which has a long-term record of safety. Neurostar TMS therapy avoids drug side effects because we know that drug therapy may cause nervousness, weakness, abnormal ejaculation, constipation, anxiety, impotence, increased appetite and weight gain, dizziness, sweating, decreased appetite, tremor, drowsiness, decreased sexual interest, headaches or migraines, and treat treatment discontinuation side effects, just to name a few. TMS therapy may also cause some side effects, which include scalp pain or discomfort at the site of stimulation, toothache, muscle twitching, facial pain, or pain of skin. In clinical trials, fewer than 5% of patients discontinue treatment with the Neurostar therapy secondary to side effects. We also know that when we utilize Neurostar therapy, there's a defined treatment course, which entails daily care that's performed in our office five days a week over a six-week time span with less than an hour per session. What are TMS treatments like? What do they look like? Well, patients can recline comfortably. They'll hear a clicking sound and feel a sensation that seems like tapping on their head.
Patients are awake and alert throughout the treatment. And patients may return to normal activities immediately after their treatment. We've stated that Neurostar is proven effective. Many people treated with Neurostar experience significant benefits. And in clinical trials, after four to six weeks of treatment, one in two improved significantly and one in three were completely free of symptoms. Follow-up treatment is determined by one's doctor. In a controlled clinical trial comparing active treatment with the Neurostar TMS therapy to an inactive device, patients treated with active Neurostar TMS therapy received average reduction in their depressive symptoms scores of 22.1% compared to a 9% average decrease in patients receiving inactive treatment. Are there risks? Well, certainly, we may mention the most common side effects associated with TMS are pain or discomfort at or near the site of stimulation, which are generally mild to moderate. And there is a rare risk of a seizure associated with treatment. This may occur in one out of 30,000 treatments. TMS cannot be utilized in individuals with implanted or non-removable metallic objects in or around their heads. Let's review what we've discussed up to this particular point. Major depressive disorder is a treatable brain disorder. Talk therapy and medications are not the only treatments that are available. Neurostar works differently than drugs and affects the brain directly. Neurostar does not cause the side effects generally associated with drug therapy, and Neurostar has been proven safe and effective in many depression sufferers. What do other Neurostar patients say? Well, here's some comments of three different individuals having gone through therapy with the Neurostar TMS system. Seven months ago, I was so depressed, I wasn't able to function. After the six weeks of Neurostar TMS treatment, I was back to work. I was feeling great and enjoying my kids once again, and I had my life back. Another patient stated, I can't begin to tell you what a difference TMS therapy made in my life. I'm just so much happier. And yet someone else stated, I've not felt this good since I was in high school. I can find joy in the simple things in life, and I no longer feel afraid to go out of the house in the morning, and I'm hopeful about my future. Let's recap what Neurostar TMS therapy entails. Neurostar TMS therapy is indicated for the treatment of major depressive disorder in adult patients who have failed to achieve satisfactory improvements on uh, their prior antidepressant medication at or above the minimal effective dose and duration in the current episode. The most common side effect related to TMS treatment is pain or discomfort at or near the treatment area during active TMS and there's a rare risk of seizure associated with TMS treatment, one out of 30,000 treatments. In open-label clinical trials, one in two patients suffering with depression improved significantly and one in three patients were completely free of depression symptoms after six weeks of treatment. In a controlled clinical trial comparing active treatment with the Neurostar TMS therapy system to an inactive device, Patients treated with active Neurostar TMS treatment received an average reduction in their depressive symptom scores of 22.1% compared to a 9% average reduction in patients receiving inactive treatment. Neurostar TMS therapy is available by prescription only. Again, I'm Dr. Gus Alva, and it's been my pleasure giving you additional information and education about how to deal with major depressive disorder at the present time. Thank you for your kind attention.